Hey, 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 what's happening? Troy here with another Monday morning, my prep, my Monday morning prep. It, one of the, I don't know. Um, one of the most important uh, things in my life next to my faith and my family. Uh, and I haven't talked about it and I'm going to today. It's coffee. Yes. Coffee makes my world go round. And I'll admit, um, <clears throat> I've already brewed some coffee, but I'm gonna show you how I'm gonna do it when stuff goes down. Uh, this is a uh, French press. Oh, pardon me. It's a French press, and uh, I don't know if you guys have used this before, but basically you put coffee grounds in here and then water, and then this thing is like a plunger with a filter, and you let it steep. That's a technical term. Uh, with it up, you let it steep for five. My daughter's barista says she goes like eight to ten, and then once the, the ten minutes have passed, you plunge it down, and basically it just takes all the coffee grounds and pushes it to the bottom, and then gives you yummy goodness off the top. Woo! Just in time, my tea pot. So this is our new teapot, and it's on this. Uh, on this cooktop I showed in another video. So this is butane. You could run this thing inside, uh, but I just heated up water in a teapot. How exciting. Um, so you may say, okay, great. You got a teapot. Why don't you just heat it up in this thing? Well, this is a double walled insulated uh, deal. So you don't want to, and it also a rubber thing on the bottom with all kinds of warnings. And you don't want to heat this up on a fire because it'll take forever. Plus it can explode or something. Anyway, so got the French press. Now, how do you make coffee beans? How do you grind coffee beans if you don't have power? This dude, this is a uh, manual, it's like old school, like a spice grinder or a coffee grinder. And what happens is you put the whole beans up here, which is more than a serving for me. And then you grind it and it puts it in the bottom. You can see a little window here. Yeah, this could, this could, okay. We only have a three minute window here, Troy. Let's go, let's do it. Ah, uh, yeah, we're getting there. So I, you can set the, you can change how big it grinds it. And I have it set to one of the larger sizes because I don't want a bunch of small coffee grounds. Oh, I think we're ready. Cool, so then this pops off and then I got the coffee grounds in there. I drop this dude in here. I feel like I'm doing a cooking show. I gotta like get to the end and then drink it and go, mmm, that's so yummy. All right, so then got coffee grounds in the bottom. I gotta push this handle. Look at this thing, this is brand new for us. I know, it's Cuisinart or something. Yeah, uh, yeah, I think so. All right, so I filled it up most of the way and boom, put that back down. All right, and then you just put the plunger down to about there. Now we gotta wait eight minutes. I'm not gonna make you wait with me. All right, it's time to plunge. Yeah, mm-hmm, mm-hmm. Uh-oh, I don't have my coffee cup ready. Make this happen, Captain. Yes, here we go. Oh, oh, I could really, this could be a, on the B-roll here. Uh-huh. That's good. You know what I think, I, I do this um, sometimes when I don't wanna make a whole pot of coffee I make uh, with the French press. It's like smoother, um, like a richer, smoother taste. Anyway. Uh, this whole preparedness thing doesn't need to be overwhelming. Just think about the things that you couldn't live without and figure out how you're gonna do it if you don't have power. Um, just simple little things. Um, I kinda like the old school. I like kinda grinding my own coffee. I think it's fun. I don't always have time for it, but uh, when and if, or if and when everything goes down, um, <laughs> we're gonna have a lot of time. So. Anyway, keep getting ready. Uh, don't be discouraged uh, by what you see in the world and uh, reach out to God. 
Blessings. New Gun Nation. Make sure to subscribe, like, and share this video with somebody that could use it.